Hello friends, welcome to this session on machine learning. Today also I will continue about linear regression. But before that I want to recap the things which I covered last time. So this was our data which was xi, yi and the model we were fitting was linear model given by yi is equal to a plus b xi where a and b are the fitting parameters and the method we used was least square method. So some of the results which we will use from the last sessions are this one that we were able to compute the value of fitting parameter a and b using the least square method and these were the values of a and b we obtained and here we defined certain quantities like this sx, sy, sxx and sxy in this way. So I want to make one important point here. Today what I am going to discuss is extremely important because it connects many different problems in machine learning and it brings in many different areas of mathematics also in the discussion. So what are these areas and problems which are introduced today? One is linear algebra. Second is statistics, third is chi-square minimization, four maximum likelihood, five regularization, fifth multivariate Gaussian. And there are many other topics also which are connected to the uh, calculation which, are, which I am going to show you today. So let us begin. So let me write the equations we have in a different form. So our data is xi, yi and the equations are like yi is equal to a plus b xi. Now let us see if I put i is equal to 1 to n what I get. I will get y1 is equal to a plus b x1 y2 is equal to a plus b x2 and y n is equal to a plus b x n. So it is straightforward to write this equation or this set of equation in this form where y is equal to a in fact we can write y is equal to ax okay where a x y where a is a matrix n x is a vector and y is also a vector Okay, so now I will write explicitly what are the values of these uh, matrices. So we can see that it is straightforward that Y matrix will be like Y1, Y2 and Yn. Okay, and X matrix is A and B and A matrix is 1 x1 2 x2 sorry 1 x1 1 x2 and so and so forth 1 x1 so I will show you that how the equations actually fit So basically if we write 1x1, 1x2 and so on and so forth, 1xn, 
मल्टीप्लाई दिस थिंग बाय ए बी यू विल हैव वाई वन एंड वाई एन लुक एट दिस मैट्रिक्स व्हाट टाइप ऑफ मैट्रिक्स इट इज इट इज एन क्रॉस टू एंड दिस मैट्रिक्स इज टू क्रॉस वन then obviously this matrix is n cross 1 so you can see that these are compatible matrices so our matrix a is n cross 2 and x is x is 2 cross One and y matrix is n cross one. So now you can see that it is straightforward easy to write the equation in this form. Or in fact, I can now clear it and 